This is the Smart Feeder from PetNet. I've been using it for a few weeks to feed my cat and found it's fantastic at its primary function, feeding your pet on an automated schedule. At $150 though, it has to do more than save you from manually feeding your pet twice a day to convince most people that it's worth buying. When you first set up the Smart Feeder, PetNet asks you various questions about your animal, including age, weight, and activity level, so it can figure out what kind of beast you're dealing with. You'll also tell the app what kind of food you use. PetNet has hundreds of brands and recipes already in its database, so you should be able to find yours without a problem. But if you can't, which I actually couldn't, you can send in your food's information so the company can add it. Once the setup is done, you'll hardly need to interact with the feeder unless you run into a problem. For instance, the app suggested I feed my cat far more than he actually eats on a daily basis, which led to the feeder clogging fairly quickly. I've since adjusted the feeding amounts, which has the smart feeder accusing me of dangerously underfeeding my cat, but in truth, he's happy with the amount of food and the clogs are gone. It's important to remember with a gadget like this that while it offers valuable information about what kind of food and how much to feed... You shouldn't take its word as gospel. Just like every person, every pet is different. So take what PetNet says and see if it actually works for your animal and adjust accordingly. Most of the time, you'll interact purely with the PetNet app, which is well-designed both aesthetically and functionally. It lets you adjust any of your automatic feeding amounts and schedules and also allows you to manually feed any time of the day or night. This is particularly useful if you have a pet, like I do, that is keen on waking you up in the middle of the night for a snack. Instead of having to drag yourself out of bed, you can just grab your phone, press a button, and as long as your pet is within hearing distance, they'll run off for a snack. The best part about the app, though, is the amount of information it offers about your pet's food. This includes nutritional value, how many calories your pet gets with each feeding, and the makeup of the food. What good things it has and what undesired components, like artificial colors, it also contains. Combined with the information you gave about your pet at setup, the guessing of whether you're feeding your pet good food and how much to give them is completely removed. But again, make sure you monitor your pet to see if the amount the app suggests is right for your cat or dog. Beyond its primary function of automatic feeds and the nutritional value it offers, there's not much to tout about the smart feeder. It does add a few other conveniences like alerting you when food is low, allowing you to order more food through the app, and a battery backup that's extremely useful if you lose power. But otherwise, there's little of note outside the smart feeder's basic function. I wish there was more here with specific diet guidance. I would love to see PetNet add in curated diets so you can help your pet get healthier while understanding the nutritional facets at play. The app currently does this in a way, but it's far more in the background. I'd like to see the company bring that aspect to the forefront so you can have a dialogue with the app about your pet's eating habits. For example, if PetNet suggests a certain amount of food for your cat when you set it up because it recognizes the animal is overweight, I want it to tell me why it chose the amount that it did. And then it could check in after some time to see if your pet has lost weight or if something needs to change. Personally, because I'm a tech nerd that has a cat who likes to wake me up in the middle of the night for food, I love the PetNet Smart Feeder, and I think $150 is a fair price given what it offers and how well it performs. I would buy it in a heartbeat, and I would recommend it to others. But I also recognize that a lot of what it offers can be accomplished with research. You can figure out what kind of food to buy and how much to feed your pet in an evening on the internet without spending any money at all. But the number one benefit it has that can't be replicated or denied is the security of knowing no matter what, your pet will be fed. If you travel a lot or live in an area like I do, where winter brings mounds of snow that could leave you stranded unexpectedly, knowing your pet won't starve is a great comfort. Thanks for watching, and be sure to stay tuned to Pace Tech for more coverage of today's best technology.